We are enjoying the lowest tax rates you'll ever see in our lifetime. And most of that is due to the Trump tax cuts passed in 2017. The bad news is, is that those uh, are scheduled to expire at the end of next year. if Congress does not act. Tax expert Ed Slot he says uh, on Morningstar that it's an opportune time for an IRA to Roth conversion. Ryan, listen to this. Remember, a lot of your IRA is a debt owed back to the government. Your IRA is an IOU to the IRS. Your IRA is a joint account with Uncle Sam. But here's the difference. With a regular joint account, you generally own half. You have a joint account with Uncle Sam where you don't know what his half will be. That's yet to be determined based on how much money the government needs at the time you take that money out. Now you do know what the rates are. You're in control. You saw me scratching my head there. Uh, that sound bite is, is so true. Um, I know you want to talk about that, but uh, when he says that it, it's yet to be determined based on how much money the government needs at the time that you take that money out, that's not a good way to go into retirement. No, that's that, that's just kind of going into retirement very, very, very blindly because, you know, I, I mean, Ed Slot is the self-proclaimed IRA expert, I think is, is what he, he talks about all the time. And this is a very, very, very common message. That, that comes out of him, from him. And, you know, I, I, I don't always agree with talking heads, but, you know, I, I agree 100% with, with what he's saying. You know, right now, the only thing that we know about taxes is that they are going to go up at the end of 2025. These current tax rates that we have, you know, the, the Trump Tax Cut and Job Act started in 2018 and has taken these, our, our tax brackets, widen the tax brackets so more income fits in these tax brackets and then lowered the overall percentages. As soon as we go um, January 1, 2026, well, the brackets shrink way back down and the, the percentages in, that you pay tax on go up. And so therefore, you go up in tax brackets much further. So while you may be thinking, you know, I, I'm only in the 22% bracket and it's going up to 25, that's only a 3% increase. Well, that's just a 3% increase there. But when you effectively take up all of the, the, how much quicker you get to that number and how much income is being taxed at that rate, it's actually more like a 12 to 15% increase wow. In, wow. in your taxes. So, you know, you, the federal government has been doing you this favor, you know, using my air quotes, this favor <laughs> of allowing you to take money from your paycheck, put it into these traditional 401ks, IRAs, 403bs, TS. Traditional means you, you're you're not paying taxes on it now. Correct. So this is the, okay. the pre-tax money that's going in. You okay. know, okay. If, you're, if you're putting money into the raw side of things, it is a different. The, it is different, but you know the the pre-tax side, which is where most people have their money going, and avoid paying tax on it now. Well, you've been avoiding paying tax on this money for the last I don't know six, seven, eight years at these low tax rates. All of a sudden, now we're gonna go back to these high tax rates. So you haven't really essentially been truly saving yourself that much money by having the money going into it. And think about, we are at the lowest tax rates we have ever seen for most people's lifetimes, the lowest tax rates that we've seen since Ronald Reagan. Taxes have to go up. As, as a country, we are spending you know, I want to say it's six point four trillion dollars a year in interest on our debt alone. That's six point four trillion dollars in interest on our credit cards as a country. And we only bring in, you know, five point five, five point eight. The numbers might be closer. I'm kind of mm -hmm. trying to go from memory here. But the bottom line is, as a country, we don't make enough money from our job to pay the interest on our credit cards. We are Just like a household. That simple. Yeah, yeah. Okay. we are borrowing 30 cents for every dollar that we spend. So taxes have to go up in the future. I don't care what side of the, the, the political sphere you fall on. Taxes have to go up in the future to pay for all this debt. They can only kick the can so far down the road. And where is the, the most amount of, of money that the federal government knows exactly where it is? They know exactly how much you have in those accounts. It's the perfect place place for them to attack, essentially, to 
generate those tax dollars. And now, now you're taking the money out. All right, you know, I'm going to retire in it's 2024. I'm 55 years old. I'm going to retire 10 years from now at, at 65 and 2034. Well, where are tax rates going to be at that point? Undoubtedly, uh, they they have to be to be higher. Why not take the opportunity now? And this is the message that you know that we've been saying since 2018. And with many of our clients, we are we are doing this. Why not do the Roth conversions now? Just like Ed is saying, take the money out of the IRA now, pay tax on it now. When I know my tax rates are lower than they will be 10 years from now, let me pay the tax on that money now allow it to continue to grow, but now it's growing tax-free. And then when I retire in 2034, when I'm 65 years old, I don't care where tax rates are because all of the money that I'm taking out of that Roth IRA is 100% tax-free to me, 100% tax-free to my spouse when I pass away. And then once again, when I die and I'm leaving any money inside of that IRA, that Roth IRA to my kids, there's no tax on it for them. You don't want to pay unnecessarily high taxes while you're alive. Why would you want to leave your kids with that burden as well by doing nothing? Take the time now to put a tax plan in place. This is what, excuse me, this is what the, the wealthy do, you know, the, the top 1% of our country, all those billionaires, is they have tax plans. It is not a coincidence that Warren Buffett pays less taxes as a percentage on his income than his secretary does. Think about that. Warren Buffett, billionaire, one of the richest people in America, I don't know how much money he makes a year, but I assume it's some egregious number, pays <laughs> less taxes as a percentage than his secretary that's probably making, you know, they're in Iowa, right? Iowa, Idaho, somewhere out there in the middle of the country, you know, she's probably making somewhere between one hundred and fifty and one hundred and seventy five thousand dollars a year. She's paying more tax on her money than a billionaire because he has a tax plan. He has a tax plan for when he's working and he has a tax plan for when he's going to be retired. That is something that you need to have. Do like the wealthy do and put a tax plan in place for your retirement. And that all starts by giving us a call at 866-597-1040, 866-597-1040. Sit down with Mike, myself, Catherine, a member of our team here at ProStatus, and we will put together your very own tax plan for retirement that talks about here's where my income's gonna come from retirement, and here's how much or how little I'm going to be paying in taxes, and quite possibly getting you down to that 0% tax bracket in retirement. That is my favorite, favorite conversation mm. to have with clients is if we follow these steps, by the time we get to X point in time, you will be paying 0% in taxes. 866-597-1040, 866-597-1040. Or you can visit us on the web at thesavvyinvestorradio.com. Click the button that says schedule my complimentary consultation right there online. Hey, we appreciate you, uh, Ryan, for doing that, for you know stepping in. And, uh, and and talking to us about this because you guys see the difference you're making in people's lives. Uh, and if you want to see if this can work for you, like Ryan said, it's a great invitation to do that. I'll give you that information uh, again here. And that is 866-597-1040 for the next Savvy Investor Callers. That's complimentary for you, 866-597-1040. And of course, as Ryan mentioned, online at thesavvyinvestorradio.com, thesavvyinvestorradio.com. You always smile. You always smile when you say the SavvyInvestorRadio.com because you know that you don't have to talk to anybody. You can just go on there, click, 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 and schedule a quick 15-minute phone conversation. You don't have to talk to anybody. You just do it online, and then you get to talk to you guys. You like that. Yeah, I, you know, I, I love that. You know, my, my wife and, and kids, we recently got a, a new puppy, and she was asking me the question of whether or not I want to use the same bed or, or switch to this one that was closer. And I went on their website and it allows me to schedule appointments right online with them. I said, fine, this is the new vet because I don't have to call and sit on hold and, you know, wait for them to tell me the dates that are available. I can just click around and say, all right, that one works for me and click. You know, that's, that's the wonderful thing about going to our website, the SavvyInvestorRadio.com. Click on, you know, schedule my 15 minute call, look at your calendar, look at our calendar in live time and set up a time to sit down with Mike, myself, Catherine and our team here at ProStatus and get your personal tax plan for retirement. 
Or we also have teammates standing by as well. 866-597-1040. Ryan, thanks again for your time, man. Uh, as always, here on the Savvy Investor Radio Show and Podcast and YouTube, make sure to subscribe, share it with your friends, enjoy the episodes that we have up there for you. You, my friend, get the final word. This is Ryan Herbert. Thank you so much for listening to the Savvy Investor Radio Show and Podcast. And we will see you, the Savvy Investor, next week.